enter an odious realm where evil is always in residence. A horrible world of pork and cannibalism. A place where you'll be chewed more than your mother's Salisbury steak. Where bodily fluid will flow more liberally than A1 on flavorless meatloaf. Enter the aging game space of Resident Evil Code Veronica X, where everything is as it was and nothing has been made current at all. Umbrella up, game fans. It's raining guano as Veronica X plods from a GameCube near you in all its year 2000 original release splendor. It's moaning zombies ahoy as you navigate the endless archipelagos of dimly lit dread, killing and collecting on the road to salvation. In the year 2000, this game had a creepy charm as evil perverted innocence and mangled corpses leapt at you from the shadows. In 2004, fear is replaced with brain-clearing frustration as you flip the switch on some gizmo only to realize you're missing the butternut squash of destiny necessary to spring someone from a locked room or door. This means backtracking through a bazillion doors, ladders, and giant worm obstacles to get back to that damn thing you forgot in order to continue. Walking and running mechanics are also made faithfully frustrating as you move, stick, and press buttons wildly trying to target the wandering legion-covered skin suits that block your path. Of course, if you're packing enough heat, none of that will really concern you much. As you immerse yourself in the drama of the storyline, you'll discover Claire Redfield has to deal with this whimpering post puber. I, I did it! And this sadistic fun guy with a wicked sense of humor. You don't fool me! All clothed in the fruity sweetness of a Days of Our Lives melody line. Welcome to the Days of Our Deceased. Brought to you by your friends at Limeaway Corpse Cleanser. Cut, cut, stop the game. I want to get off. Awkward control, sleepy puzzles, aggravating targeting, and endless backtracking. What's to love here, folks? Especially for the less than reissue price tag of $39.99. For those of you this game gave that creepy feeling to all the way back in 2000, you can have that nostalgia back again. For us, its expiration date is long past. We give it a one out of five. Father!